The search for life starts with having the right ingredients. Carl Sagan said, if you wish to make an apple pie from scratch, you must first invent the universe. This is because everything around us is made of chemical elements. However, the start of the universe, the Big Bang, only creates three elements, hydrogen, helium, and lithium. That's not enough for an apple pie. So to be more accurate, we should add to this statement and also explode a bunch of stars. Stars are constantly undergoing fusion to create elements heavier and heavier up until iron. After iron, everything else is created in supernova. Life needs a cer certain proportion of elements to flourish on Earth, such as oxygen, carbon, and phosphorus. When we think of explosions, we often think of spherical shells, like the expanding of a uh, birthday balloon. But supernova do not explode perfectly uniformly. Instead, they have preferential directions for certain elements, which means some stars get more of an element than others. I like to think of it as blowing on a dandelion. Spores go randomly through the air, and to an observer, their paths may seem erratic. But we can explain it with physics. This is just like how important biological and planetary elements are delivered to stars. And if you could imagine that each one of these dandelion spores represents a different element or ingredient, like sugar, flour, or cinnamon, if you were to make a pie, you would want the correct proportions of these ingredients. A little too much sugar, an extra pinch of cinnamon, people won't notice. But if you put in five times as much salt, no one's gonna eat your pie. This is the same thing for life. Life needs the right proportion of elements. So if you are wondering if your favorite star has the right ingredients for life, it'd be like me asking, what are the odds of one of my dandelion spores landing on the person in the second row, third from the left? The answer is minimal. But if instead I ask, what are the odds of my dandelion spores landing on anyone in this room without discriminating as to whom, now your odds are kind of impressive. So when you're searching for life in the galaxy, you might not find it around the stars you want, like Alpha Centauri. But if you keep searching, there should be plenty of stars with the right materials to form life and pie.